I'm going to talk you through our A-Stop technologies for our CAT command systems. So we receive questions around safety on the job site when remote control machines are in use. So for example, what would you do if a customer on site needs to stop a machine that is being remotely controlled many miles away or even in the site office? We have the A-Stop system solution that is designed to be used by a person on the job site that enables them to stop all remotely controlled machines in their vicinity via dedicated radio signal. So let me walk you through those steps. So here we have a D7 being remotely controlled by a CAT command station. You'll see the flashing blue light indicating that it is connected and it's being controlled via CAT command. So say there's an emergency or an unplanned event and I need to stop all of the CAT command remotely controlled machines, I'm going to use the A-Stop technology. First of all, I will press and hold the red A-Stop button on the transmitter. The red LED light next to the A-Stop button will begin to flash and the remotely controlled machines will stop and reach a safe state. The transmitter will provide a beeping tone to confirm that the A-Stop button has been pressed. The A-Stop signal will transmit continuously until a clear signal has been activated by a person with the A-Stop transmitter. On each remotely controlled machine with an A-Stop receiver, the blue light will move to a solid mode which showing that it is still in remote control mode but it is no longer being remotely controlled. You'll also notice that the red indicator light begins flashing showing that the machine has been stopped by an A-Stop transmitter. The operator in the CAT command station, they'll receive a message on the operator display informing them that the machine has been stopped by someone on site with the A-STOP transmitter. This operator cannot continue to operate the machine by a remote control until the clear signal is activated by the person on site with the A-STOP transmitter. So once I'm happy to reactivate the remotely controlled machines with CAT command, I communicate to the operator that they are now clear to restart work and I press the green clear A-STOP button. The operator will confirm on the operator's screen that the A-STOP message has been cleared and that they can reconnect to the machine to begin remote control operations. So that was a very quick overview of our A-STOP solution. If you'd like to find out more about our CAT command technologies, please contact your local CAT dealer or visit us on cat.com.